We're in an Indiana cornfield today to determine if the symptoms we're seeing on corn are a disease problem or from herbicide drift. The symptoms in question that we're seeing in Indiana cornfields are similar to both Holcus leaf spot, which is caused by a bacteria, and Gramoxone drift. Now these are going to be spots on corn that are going to be yellow or pale and may have a yellow halo surrounding the lesion. We're seeing them on some of the older leaves, um, but also along the leaf edges. If we're seeing these in its Holcus leaf spot, this is a disease that we see very infrequently and sporadically in Indiana, and it's not typically a problem that we're concerned about. However, when growers are seeing these spots on leaves, they are concerned about the impact on yield. And they're also concerned on whether or not it's Holcus or maybe it's a drift problem. So Travis, how do we know if this is a drift problem? Well, if this is a drift problem, uh, as Kirsten said, it's going to be similar to Gramoxone drift. So with Gramoxone drift, the first key is to look for a field that's had a burn down. Gramoxone is only going to be sprayed on those fields with burn downs. Once you find a field surrounding the symptoms that has had a burn down, then you need to look for those drift patterns. And that's with the most uh, amount of lesions or spots being closest to that herbicide application and then uh, go, decreasing as you go away from that target site uh, to a point where you don't have any symptoms. Any plants that exist between the site that had the burn down and your corn of question, those plants will also be affected because it is a broad spectrum herbicide. So look at all the weeds in the alleyways or the fence rows or the road ditches that are in between the two fields and all of those weeds will be affected as well. So Travis, we've looked at the symptoms in this cornfield and we don't have any fields around here that have had a burn down application. We're not seeing any of the same symptoms, any of the spots in the plants or the weeds in the alleyways or in the adjoining soybean field. So what's your verdict? Is this a drift issue? My verdict is that it's not a drift issue. Without any of those symptoms or a field with a burn down in the area, uh, it would not be a drift issue. Well, I guess based on the pattern that we're seeing of these spots, we, we'd have to say that this is probably Holcus leaf spot in this cornfield. If you're not sure whether or not you have Holcus leaf spot or a drift issue, you can always submit samples to our Purdue Plant and Pest Diagnostic Lab. And if you think it's a drift problem, if you're sending it into the Plant and Pest Diagnostic Lab, please also send along with those samples pictures of the field of those patterns that you think uh, you might be seeing and that will help us assess whether it's drift or Holcus spot. If it's Holcus leaf spot, really no management is necessary. Fungicide applications will not do anything to, to control the symptoms that you're seeing because um, Holcus leaf spot is not caused by a fungal disease. Also, there are no products that we would recommend spraying and most of the times corn will just grow out of the symptoms and, and we won't expect to see any yield loss.